Hello and welcome. We're now looking at an event planning best practice board. And if you look at this event planning board, you'll notice just as is the case with the editorial calendar, you'll notice that each major step in the timeline is lined across the top to the right. What's different about the way this board is managed is that each card is a task and each task has a specific member assigned to it. And remember, we can do that by going into a particular card, going to add a member, and making sure that there's only one member added to that card. And what will happen is that that person's avatar will actually show up on the front of the card. And so although the team is given access to the discussions, each team member is responsible for the checklist in their particular card. Now it's a minor point, but it's one worth mentioning that this board actually has a different kind of background. And typically you can go to the menu to find out what that color or photo is. In the case of the board that was created earlier, we can go to the menu and you'll notice that there is a change background link there. That If we click it, we can either change the color or add a photo to the background. Now in this case, the event itself has a due date, and the due dates were not set ahead of time, obviously, for the task to be completed. However, the fact that someone has been assigned to each task moves the process forward in a way that a date may not be able to. Now clearly, this is an annual event. So once the event has been completed, we would want to be able to save this entire board so that we would be able to use it again the following year. And in this case, what we would do is we would go to our menu, we would copy the board, we would add the copy to our team, we'd keep the cards and then click create. Once that board becomes a team board, we can then open the board and we can add it to a specific collection. In this case, we'll need to create a collection and we'll then enable this board to be added to our new collection. Okay, so with that, thanks and I will see you in another video.